A is a partner in a firm in which his opening balance of fixed capital on 1-1-2011 was rupees 2 lakh. So you have A, let me use a different color here, A who is a partner in a firm, okay, on 1-1-2011 his capital is 2 lakh. He introduced additional capital of rupees 50,000 on May 1, 2011. So 1, 5, 2011, he introduced additional capital of 50,000, right? Assuming the profits are 2 lakh for the year and interest on capital is to be provided at 15% per annum, what shall be the amount of interest payable to A for the year ended December 31, 2011? So your year basically ends on what date? Year ended. 31-12-2011. Right? 31-12-2011. So basically what is happening here is you have opening capital and the capital which is introduced during the year which is this one is known as additional capital. Right? So you have an opening balance of capital account, you have an additional capital account, you know that the rate of interest is 15%, you are asked to find out how much interest on capital is to be provided. Now one of the things which you should know is that interest on capital is provided both on the opening balance as well as the additional balance, subject of course to the profits during the year and the terms of the partnership deed. Right? So in this case, if you notice, what is the total profit available for the year? It's 2 lakh. So let us first find out what is the interest on capital which has to be paid. So for the first opening capital, it was from 1 1 2011 until 31 2012. I used it for how many? 12 months. So the period is 12 months. For additional capital, it is from 1 5 2011 until 31 12 2011. This period is going to be 8 months. Because this is 1-5. It was if it was 31-5, then this would have been seven months. So just be a little careful as whenever you are doing any kind of questions, what is this date? Right? How much is the interest? Interest is equal to principal. What is the principal here? It's the amount of capital which is contributed into rate. Rate is 15% into time. Time is 12 months. Or in other words, it's one year only. So 12 divided by 12. Right? This will give you basically how much? 1, 2, 15 into 2,000 or 30,000. Right? For the second one, how much is the capital introduced? It's 50,000 into 15% into what is the period 8 months 8 divided by 12 right so here basically 1 2 1 2 right 3 times 4 5 times 3 2 2 into 5 gives you 10 10 into 500 will give you 5000 so the total interest is 30 plus 5 35000 as I said, this interest is subject to the terms of the partnership deed and profits because we have profits of 2 lakh, so obviously we don't have an issue in terms of giving this interest on capital. We'll see some more complicated problems where the interest is more than actually the profits available and see how we deal with those situations in subsequent videos. Right? I hope you would have liked this video. In case not, please hit the dislike button at the bottom. As a contrary thing, if you like this video, please hit the like button, right? Because your dislikes help us to improve, your like encourages us to do more work. You can also visit our website www.iadiobook.com in case you are not already on this website as you are watching this video, right? We have more than 1500 videos on maths, physics, chemistry, science, biology, accounts, economics, and other subjects, right? So have a happy learning and thanks for being with us today.